Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. And the time we waited for Vodafone Idea Limited results has come, and uh, I want all of the persons or all of my friends who are listening this video to see fully this video. This video may extend up to 10 minutes also, guys, because the data and content which they have provided is very very important because you you should know what have they done and what will be the future and what will be the price moment and you must definitely see it guys and uh, if you are new to this channel then make sure you click the subscribe button because you could get our latest updates regarding many shares so i want this content with this and clear so i want to explain you a lot so it may take time guys and the first and foremost thing we want to say is that the result was been con concluded at 6:30 pm and now 6:40 or 6:47 they have released this result and now what they are say, trying to say is very very important things so first of all before explaining the clear content to you we must first know the result so we are going to first say the result guys so that it could help you a lot since they have given the amount in millions we want to give you in crores so that it could help you a lot so the <coughs> so the first thing they have done is the revenue from operations 1,10,894 million is nothing but 11,000 crores. 11,000 crores is the amount of revenue. That means revenue has increased in over a year. Limited. You can say yes, the company has posted loss this time also. But you should note that due to the increase in tariff price of the I mean the plan recharge plan and also you should know that several subscribers has left even after subscribers has left the increase in tariff has increased in the revenue to Vodafone Limited so from 10,800 crores now it is 11,000 I mean 11,000 crores is the revenue so the total income of the other income also added is coming around 11,400 crores is the revenue versus 11,100 crores which means I think there is around 1 to 2 percent increase in the revenue guys and let us see any other things and cost of trade goods is coming is coming under a small range and also you should note that the employee benefit expense has been reduced which is a good point but also you should note the main factor here because of the main point which made roaming and access charges this has been the main expenses 16,402 uh, million that has been the main expenses and also you should note the depreciation I mean, amortization expenses so what is this people you may ask guys depreciation and amortization expenses are those for the towers they are having their towers right for towers and other other instruments missionaries which are they having for which they have to provide the depreciation and it is coming around a hell a lot of amount guys and the total expenses is coming around 17,268 crores I, they have given 1,700,685 million so in crores it is nothing but 17,268 crores so the total loss is coming around the profit before is coming around 5,880 crores that means loss has been reduced so this is a very very important point to note guys because previous quarter without this AGR issue the loss was 6,314 but now after this age issue and after this revenue due to revenue increase the loss has been come down so the loss is now around 5880 crore and also you should note the main point that exceptional items are given note 7 we are going to see the note 7 item last but we want to see the results fully guys and the next thing is that the profit before tax as you can see here the profit before exceptional item and tax and after tax is coming around 6438 they are given 64,000 therefore it is nothing but 6438 is the loss this is a loss of 50,000 crore previous quarter so previous year it was around 5,000 crore now it is 6 now it is 6438 crore is the amount of loss and also you should know that the loss has reduced and there is very very important point note so seeing these financials you are getting a good point that the uh, loss has been reduced as you can see here guys profit before exceptional items and associate tax it is coming around 5880 crore but previous quarter it is 6314 crores previous year 6243 crores that means due to revenue increase they have reduced their tax I mean they have reduced their 
loss before tax and other extraordinary items guys and this is very very good news you should note and next point you should see here is that the note number 7 we already see here guys and we are going to see that note 7 because they have given clear indication please see the note 7 this you can see guys extraordinary items see the note 7 so first go let's go and see the note 7 item because we want to see what is note 7 first of all so let us go down so that we could see here and they have given what was the main how they arrived this uh, amount of uh, amount of exceptional item amount this is a given in millions guys and how they have arrived let us see integration and merger related cost so merger related cost is coming around 4020 million and also the main point age are liability Age and liability they have included extra 528 million. So they have given refer 0.4a. Now let us go and see the 0.4a guys because we want to go part by part. Please listen it fully guys because very very important you should know because you have invested in this company. And they have given the honorary supreme court has passed the judgment as, you, as we all know guys. And also a review petition was filed by the company which was dismissed on January 16th. Thereafter, the company hand and some of the telecom operators have filed the application for modification of supplementary order before the Hall of the Supreme Court of India. And also, this modification letter permit devoted decide on schedule. And they are seeking a modification of the order and permit Department of Education to decide the schedule of payments and other relief, which is yet to be heard pending which the company has not met any payment. So it's a very very good news guys. They have only created the provision of 50,000 crore or the HR amount. They have not paid till the amount due to the Supreme Court issue is pending. So that is a very very good news. And also second point is note that following the judgment the company has recognized the total estimated liability of this 4 lakh uh, 40,000 million they have recognized that is 44,000 crores they have recognized. And also you should note that Further, as directed by DOT, the company is undertaking self assessment exercise for the competition of liability. So, basically, what I have given if the Supreme Court, the review petition and the next petition has been failed, then Board of One Idea is doing their own calculation for this AGR judgment, guys. And the next thing you should note, let us come down and see, let us uh, get any other things. And also, you should note, guys, uh, the financial distance of Board of One Idea stand loan. Uh, that there has been a reduce in loss and this is a very very important point to note guys and also there is some other important point because I mean the management should have given their uh, review on it and we are going to see the review that management has given because management review is very very important and this is uh, Vodafone Internet Limited unnoted results this is also the consolidated unnoted results that they are given so it is on the same side uh, but the main factor hiding here is the amount of the revenue increase and the subscriber base they have now because they want to know this point ah dear guys this is the main point media release revenue tar turnaround with the revenue of 2.3 percent has been increased by strong 4g additions that means subscriber base has been increased by the 4g additions and also indication progressing well with 80% 86% of distinct consolidators. So they have formulated a detailed plan and schedule in order to give this beautiful tower connections, guys. And the next point you should notice that revenue grew by 2.3% quarter over that we said first is that guys growth in 4G additions have average daily revenue, and also you should note that 4G subscribers is now at 104 million. 4G net addition accept to 8.3 million during this quarter. Guys, this is very very important. 4G net additions accelerated to 8.3 million. That means 83 lakhs during the year. So it has been accelerated in this quarter. So that is very 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 important news. And also you should note that fastest 4G network in three metros, Delhi, Mumbai, and Kolkata, along with West Bengal, Uttar Pradesh. And also they have said that uh, LT and rollout has been expanded to nine circles. So this is the very very important point you should note, guys. For the subscribers is now at 104 million. For the net additions accelerated to 83 lakh. That means 83 million during this quarter. And this is very very important news. And finally, we are going to see this very very important news. Another thing, the management has said that the CEO has said this company that 
B continue to actively engage with the government seeking relief on AGR and other matters. Post dismissal of a review petition, D have filed for modification of supplementary order the Supreme Court. At the same time, B remain focused on rapid network integration as well as 4G coverage and capacity, especially in key markets. So what they are trying to say means we are not shutting the stop and Vodafone Idea has been doing this job and also said that Vodafone Idea with other companies like Altair Limited has submitted a supplementary material with the Supreme Court in order to give them their conditions so that it could help them and also you should note that as a result after several quarters of pressure of top lane we witness consistent revenue turnaround from September onwards. So this is a very very good point guys. So what they are trying to say because of geo entry the revenues of all telecom companies has been decreased but the, after September the Vodafone Idea Limited and Altel and also Geo has tried to increase their mobile tariff and which has made these customers to I mean it has made the customers to pay more and earn more for these companies and also which has contributed to robust for the subscriber additions and this is a very very good news guys three good news but one last news the final impact I will say lastly so till now was it clearly guys and they have set a beautiful plan and they have given the financial results this and you should note that AP, ARP, average revenue per user is being increased and this is very very important point to note and also operational uh, highlights are given as you can see here ARPU has been improved to 109 rupees versus 107 rupees. If we say just 2 rupees, then sorry guys, there are totally 100 million subscribers now. For one person, it's 2 rupees. Then multiply the total amount for 100 million subscribers who are using their word of an idea. And also think about the additions you are going to make. And also think about the tab influence which are going to introduce new. And word of an idea is not going to shut the stop. And this is what they have said finally and they are going to say that 24th February 2020 there is a merger plan or there is an asset foundation of index tower and this they are given and totally guys hands crossed if you ask me what to do now what will you do if you ask me guys guys I think this is the longest video we have ever made for Vodafone Unlimited so if you listen this video fully guys then you are very very benefited because you have known now various information so what are you expecting? We are expecting a strong pullback in the share up to 7.35 rupees. If the share goes down tomorrow, we will definitely buy. So people who are holding at 5 rupees, 6 rupees, 7 rupees, definitely hold. We are seeing for a pullback in the share because revenue was increased. Second thing, age is to be completed. Third thing, index tower is good. Index tower deals, asset monitoring is going to be completed. Fourth, integration of uh, districts at 86 percentage. Fifth. Average 70 per user has been increased. Loss also decreased for the 6 points. So finally they are posting losses. But the loss has been decreased. And this is about board of Internet limited guys. I hope I have provided my best. If I seen this video till now then I hope you have liked my video like my channel. So click the subscribe button below. So that you could get our latest updates regarding many shares. And leave any comments below so that we could help you out. And see you in the video very soon guys.